I'm Emily Rose. And I'm Dan Philgreen. Welcome to the weekend edition of Shell Point Today for July 5th, 6th, and 7th. We're wrapping up the week by inviting Sunny Torres into the studio to offer an inspiring devotional. You know, I think butterflies should be one of the seven wonders of the world. We're learning why Chef John and the Banyan Grill are getting a jump start on their holiday dining plans. Um, we know how much everybody loves Thanksgiving, so we thought, what do we want to do six months from actual Thanksgiving? Why not a Thanksgiving in July? Plus, we're taking a look back at some of the top stories from the past week. But first, we're taking over the beach as part of our look back on this day in history. It was 73 years ago when French designer Louis Riard unveiled his soon-to-be fashion staple of summer, the bikini. Two-piece bathing suits began emerging on European beaches in the 1930s, and it was during World War II when they made their way to America due to fabric wartime rationing, if you can believe it. However, it was in 1946 when Jacques Heim and Louis Riard completed their prototype for what they called the world's smallest bathing suit. Named after the island of Bikini Atoll, their original design featured just a scant 30 inches of fabric. It was claimed that for it to be a genuine bikini, it had to be small enough to be pulled through a wedding ring. The design was an instant success in Europe. However, it was struggling to break into the U.S. fashion market. It wasn't until the 1960s when the bikini could be seen turning up on American beaches, soon becoming an icon of the all-American summer. Another summer tradition, cooling off with a refreshingly cold ice cream. And next week, you can enjoy some of the best frozen sweets courtesy of Sub-Zero Nitrogen Ice Cream. On July 9th, head to the Grand Cypress Room at 1 p.m. for this special educational ice cream party. Learn how they create this frozen delicacy with a hands-on presentation. Then, when things wrap up, everyone gets their own bowl of the concoction. The best part, the whole event is free. Simply head to the Woodlands Commons and join your friends and neighbors in celebration of National Ice Cream Month by enjoying the process and results of creating nitrogen-infused ice cream with Sub-Zero. Also happening next week, the Community Thrift Store is going all out for their anniversary sale. Beginning July 9th, the shop is celebrating eight years of savings by offering 50% off everything in the store. That's half, half off all furniture, clothing, household items, appliances, and much, much more. You'll also have the opportunity to win door prizes and participate in a silent auction. If you'd like more information regarding the Community Thrift Store's 8th anniversary sale, give the shop a call at 225-6529. Believe it or not, but we are only 21 weeks away from Thanksgiving. However, Chef John and the team at the Banyan Grill aren't waiting that long. They're already prepping their birds as they get ready to celebrate Thanksgiving in July.